Hello, my name is Lachlan. Uh, I'm one of the pharmacists with Men's Health Done Under. I'm just going to do a quick video to show you how to draw up a dose from a multi-use vial for intracavernosal injection. So first things first, this vial, when it first comes to you, will have a plastic cap on top. Pop that off. That cap does not have to go back on ever. That's just the first time. On all subsequent uses, we need to maintain the sterility of that vial. So what we'll do is we'll, using an alcohol swab, we're going to wipe the rubber bung. You can see there's a metal outer part and a rubber inner component. The rubber inner component is the bung. Let's just give it a once over. Now, the important step is to leave that for 30 seconds so that it can dry. The importance of that is the alcohol in this can actually destroy the medication if it gets in and it can be irritating to the skin. And we need to wait until it's completely dry so that it's actually sterile. Now, the needles that we use are insulin needles. The full volume is one mil and that's broken up into 100 units. So as you can see, there's 10 units, 20, 30, 40, all the way up to 100. With the syringe, hold it by the body and pull off the orange cap straight. Um, be careful not to kind of rebound back because that's an easy way to give yourself a needle stick injury. That needle is incredibly fine and soft. Uh, it's important that any time you're pushing this into something, you go straight in and don't wiggle it around because you can really easily bend that needle. Once your bung has dried, Hold it straight, put the needle on top and push straight in like that. Then invert it. Now you need to make sure that the needle head, which you can see in there, is beneath the level of the liquid. Um, this will be quite easy when you first get the medication it's, as it's going to be quite full. But on subsequent uses, you may just need to pull it down a little bit to make sure that you don't draw up just air and no drug. To draw up the dose, hold the body of the syringe and then with your other fingers, pull down on the plunger like that. Just go straight down, making sure to keep the needle straight. Now I find the easiest way is to overdraw. So I've drawn down to 30 units. Overdraw, keep an eye on the dose with your eyes level to the syringe and push straight back up to the dose that you want. In this case, I'll do 10 units. Reinvert it so that you don't lose any liquid when you pull out and remove. That then can go straight back in the fridge because these intracavernous injections are all cold and that dose is ready to go. Drawing up the dose, you can see that there's a thick rubber piece and a thin rubber piece. The thin rubber piece is what you measure the dose from. So that's right on 10 units. That is 10 units of drug. If there are any bubbles in the top, you can give them a flick and push them out. Um, hopefully though, overdrawing it and then pushing the excess back in will remove any bubbles. Tiny, tiny bubbles aren't a problem. You don't want to be injecting large bubbles, however. That's ready to go. Um, needs to be used as soon as it's made up, unless otherwise advised. Thank you.